What's going on here? It's your boy Jungle 972 back here, and welcome back to Chrono Trigger uh, Definitive Edition on PC. We last left off, we took care of Ozzy and actually we took care of Flea and Slash. We haven't taken care of Ozzy yet, so but for right now we gotta keep running. The, we gotta run the gauntlet for a little while. Let's see. Take care of these guys real quick. Uh, it's nice and chilly outside today too, so it's kind of nice to be here in the pod as well. Oh, and by the way, I have decided. Uh, today that I'm using my Xbox One controller. So yes, my Xbox One controller uh, today. My PS4 is in the uh, other room at the moment, along with my PS4 controller too. So take these guys out real quick. Oh yeah. Alrighty. Oh yes. Okay, he's learned heal. Let's see, aerial strike. Close to haste. Hang on. Close. Needs a little bit of work though, but yes. Soon. All right. Two, these two sorcerers real quick. Take care of these guys real quick, and boom. Also, it was also kind of nice uh, in the previous episode that I ended up I decided to do it uh, uncut, by the way, too. I decided to just make that episode completely uncut, though, because there was just too much fun, you know, going into that book. And why, you know, and why not, you know, if you ask me, Magus' Castle, in general, does ne should never, ever be cut, too. Well, and maybe on today's episode, though, because of uh, what I got going on later. Uh, Ozzy plays a couple of tricks, too, that's also pretty time-consuming as well, so you might as well. Alrighty. What do you got? Six on three, man. They really didn't do much with the frame rate with lightning, too. You know what? And you know, I've been taking a look at you know some of the differences on the DS version as opposed to the uh, SNES and the uh, current version right now. There's a you know pretty good amount of di you know pretty good amount of subtle differences though. But I got to tell you, some of these. Are good. Some of these just kind of hold it back in some ways, you know. It usually has to do with the little things. Though. Honestly, you know, the PC version has a, still has a lot more to be desired. Of course, I think all of us you know, are waiting for, I guess, you know, like a remake of this game. I don't know if there is though, because I'm all over it. So, so you've made it. Slash, flee. Pardons, Ozzy. They cannot help you anymore. You fly-eating, tongue-flicking. Ozzy's in a pickle. You'll not escape us. You'll not escape us. Alrighty. Up we go. Welcome! Dark mail. This goes to... Yep. Give her the mist robe. Give Chrono the ruby vest. Alrighty. <laughs> Not bad. How's this? Wait. Up we go. <laughs> Not hit. <sighs> what? Impossible. Hmm. Dead claw. This goes to T260. All right, then we got this little side cloak, this little side ledge over here. Go down. I ain't got time to be fighting these guys, man. Cause alrighty, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, moving to the groove, to the moving, to the groove, to the moving. Oh, holy shit, that actually worked! Holy shit, that actually. Oh no, no. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Ah. Uh. See what I mean? Alrighty. Move here, move here. Of course. Of course. Never thought I'd actually be hitting the majority of these. Finally. 
Alrighty. And it looks like we have to fight through these over here. Hang on. Alright, here we go. <sighs> Whoa! Oh, I forgot about that. Combo counter. Oh, wow, you got a fire roll of your own, too. Okay. Nah, I got enough, though. Okay, so magic is your current is your current weakness. And it's about to switch over to the physical. Let's go away. Alrighty. Moving forward, moving forward. Of course, you got this guy here, too. Finish him off real quick. Moving forward. Finish him right before he explodes. Supposed to give you a pretty good amount of experience points, too. Oh, look at that. Not too bad. Not bad at all. Moving forward. Got another bird, man. Ah, get out of here already. You know what? I've already had my coffee, so I have no reason to be kind of annoyed, though. But, you know, we're just going to ignore him. Can't ignore him, though. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah! <laughs> All right, and we have another uh, small one. We do have another. Um, what is it? Damn, I cannot talk today. Another gauntlet to run. Here we go. Gets fun here too. I like these fights though. Except for the last wave that we have over here. Let's see. Okay, no sword stream here. Ice water it is. Ah. <sighs> Easy peasy. Keep going forward. Wave number two. We got. Oh yeah, you got this little magic man. Lightning two. Okay. Focus one attack on these guys. Take these two out. Be a pain in the ass sometimes. Back to magic. Uh, X strike. Take him out. Okay, he's done. Very much done. Oh, goodness, goodness, goodness. Ah, so it is Sunday today, and I'm really hoping that some more good news can come out of this stupid pandemic, man. I swear to God. Nothing ever comes good out of this, you know, but other than, you know, the fact that nature it looks really nice and the carbon emissions aren't doing very well. Man, I gotta tell you, man. It really goes to show you just how much planet Earth, you know, can be uh, overwritten by humans and how much humans can really, really damage, you know, things that, that are needed. Alrighty. Ooh, what do we got here? Before these jugglers use magic. Ice water. Cleave. Alrighty. Take care of these guys right here. Now we can get physical attacks. 
Yeah, they just keep throwing fire at us, though. That's the only thing I don't like about this. They just keep throwing fire. I'm not a goddamn juggler. Hang on, hang on. Almost done, almost done. There's a treasure right above us, too, man. There's a treasure right above us, so let's finish this guy off. Ozzy, you're next. He's <laughs> just pointing out. <laughs> you're next, pal. Uh, what impossible? <laughs> He's all frantic. Uh, uh, uh. You weren't supposed to make it this far. That's the bad part, though. You don't never ever underestimate your enemies. Oh! Okay. We'll max out your speed. How about that? Max out your speed this way. Oh, and we have a third wave of enemies, too. Alright. I completely forgot. There's three gauntlets you have to run. He's a little bit more physical attack based, though. Not so much magic, though. Not so much magic. Alrighty. Lens level increased. Nope. I was wrong. Lightning 2. We'll slurp slash this little juggler over here. And of course, those birds won't take any damage, so I probably should have waited on that. Come here. Woo! Alrighty. Alrighty. What do we got here? Alrighty. You know, playing this on an Xbox One controller, I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty nice though, but I can definitely see the difference right now. Mainly because, since, you know, well, Steam is mainly Microsoft based too, you know, the OS is uh, Microsoft, definitely works a little bit better. It actually responds a little bit, a little bit quicker now. Okay. Alrighty. And then we'll cleave this bad boy up here. Took that out. So yeah, I just may, you know, continue this playthrough with my Xbox One controller. You know what? I think I can actually skip this fight, too. You know what? There is no fight. Uh, huh. Alrighty, hang on. Then we got Ozzy. Of course, I'm going to take these before the fight starts. Because <laughs> this battle's already won as this. <sighs> Ozzy, your time is nigh. <laughs> Lord Mega should have finished summoning Lavos by now. I won't be defeated by you. I won't. No attack can pierce my barrier. I'm invincible. God damn it! Of course you are. But you know what else is invincible too? Nothing else. Because you just gotta keep hitting these switches. Ha ha ha! Miss me! What are you aiming at, you fool? It sucks though because you don't get any experience points for this fight. What are you aiming at? Show the victor go to go to spoils. Ha ha ha! Miss me! Alrighty. You know what? You may be invincible, but you know glass does shatter. <laughs> uh. Oh, crikey. Okay, he ain't gonna be walking after that. That was a breeze. Yes, it was. Time is our enemy now. We must hurry to Magus. Now, hold on one second. Let me get prepared for our fight with Magus real quick. Okay, I just noticed something with this. Hold on one second. Let me switch over here. You can actually hear the chanting get louder as you go down. On the uh, Super Nintendo version and on the DS version, it doesn't get louder. It actually stays at the same volume. Also, you can actually leave and go back. You can, you can actually leave and return to this particular area and fight off these bats and start grinding. 
you get a really good amount of experience points dude, not to mention a pretty good amount of attack points as well. Well, I mean, hold on. Let me show you what I mean. You get a really good uh, amount of, pretty good amount of experience points. 12 tech points, which will gain up quick, 420 uh, gold. And all you gotta do is leave, come back, leave, come back, leave, come back. That way, if you've got techniques that you want to learn, you can do it right here, right before you fight, Max, if you feel like you're unprepared. Plus, save points right there, if you have a shelter, boom, healed up, ready to go. Dazma Fara Olira. Here it comes. Cast open the gates that line betwixt heaven and earth. In exchange for the life of this world. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, Toy Animation needs to make this into an anime. God, I love this scene too. <laughs> I'll tell you this Scott McNeil should voice uh, fucking Magus. Oh, yeah, we're ready for you. We're ready for you, Magus. Can't get enough of that sugar crisp. Keeps me going strong. Hmm. Magus! <sighs> A frog of so many days ago. Have you how have you fared since we last met? Well enough. I owe you my gratitude. This form has been a blessing in disguise. Without it, <laughs> there are things I've never have never attained. Hmm, the mass of moon. So you brought some for me after all. Let us hope that no others make their way. Blah, didn't read that quick enough. Again, the bitter black wind begins to howl. Very well. Well, you know what? We're prepared for the void. Let's just put it this way. Okay, where are you going to start off with? Okay, so you're just going to sap our... You're just going to sap our HP. That's what you're going to do. Alright. Lower your magic defense real quick. Okay, what are you going to do? Absorbs all but light. Alrighty. Duly noted. Duly noted. Right to a lightning rod. Oh yeah! That deserves all but water. Alrighty. Yeah, you gotta be really patient with him too. Okay, you know what? Then a sword stream it is. And a lapis to heal. You know, when I was a kid, I used to have... Like, the very first time I fought Magus, I had the toughest time trying to figure him out though, so all I did was just use regular attacks. And it took forever! <laughs> But when I was a kid, though, you know, it also took, also took me uh, forever to realize that, hey, this guy actually uses <laughs> whatever uh, magic that he uses, that's what he's weak against. Well, for this time. Man, it's gonna hurt. Right to the spine, too. Alright. Alright. Cool, we'll play that, we'll play that game. Bring on the fire! Right with the monster move. Yeah. Or is his guard before cat? Oh, he's gonna cast a spell, are you? Oh, get ready for dark matter. He's got no weakness right now, so I can hit him wherever the fuck I want. Right with fire sword. One thing is, though, he's got 6,666 HP. Doesn't get more metal than that. Yeah. 
Dark magic. Feed Lord's strongest magic attack. Nicely done. Alrighty. Back to a lightning rod again. Hit you with some napalm. Easy as pie. Lord's is guard to begin casting a spell. Okay. What do you got, Magus? What do you got? Defeat Lord's strongest magic attack. Don't worry, we'll survive. Can't get enough of that sugar crisp. Keeps me going strong. Keeps me going strong. Can't get enough of that. Mid potion. Come on, Magus. Your turn again, man. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? 1500 EXP. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Your skill with the Master Moon is that great already? What's happening? Could it be Lavos? Ugh. No, he mustn't awaken from his slumber yet. What do you mean? Did you cre didn't you create him? You fools! I but summoned I but summoned him. He has dwelt within the earth for aeons, absorbing the land's en energy and growing forever stronger. Then he wasn't born in this age. No, he wasn't. What is this? What is this energy in the air? A gate? And a huge one, too. You... If you had not interfered... Oh, yeah, Raw being drawn. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, man, they took away some of the sound, too. Oh... <laughs> Crono Crono Crono, are you still sleeping? And you'll be late for work. Damn it, I forgot how beautiful Lean's Bell sounds. Crono, we can't keep asking my father for help. We need to hold down a job. Chrono! Chrono, 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 Chrono! And here we are, back in prehistoric times. Chrono, awake! Ilya! Ilya want, Ilya want to see Chrono go, Mystic Mountain, you there, fall down hurt. Ilya carry it back hut. Magus! Big frog present? For Isla eat? P perish the thought. But what of a pale faced man in a cape? Was he not with us? No, only find you. Cape, one more tasting? <laughs> so he has fled. Nagus said that Lavos had existed since ancient times. Lavos? You know where now. You rest, hurt bad. And you know what? And we'll take this off in the next episode. Much love, and uh, peace! Chrono okay now. I live busy. Try to find Larupa village. Hmm. Find village, fight reptiles together. Big fight, last fight. Beat our reptiles, or reptiles beat us all. You know! What wrong? Chrono rest, you be quiet. North wood fire. Burn! Big burn! Yeah, next episode. Peace.